YouTube, it's Nikki. Um, this is my second video. After I got done doing the first one, I realized it was 24 minutes long, and that won't transfer off my phone, and I left my other camera at home. Um, so I want to give you some numbers, okay? Uh, highest weight, 307. Um, the, how much I weighed the first time I went to a bariatric surgeon was 298. I um, was 289 at the beginning of my two-week um, pre-op liquid diet. I, after, at night before surgery, was 282, and I'm currently 274. So I'm doing good. Today is one week post-op gastric bypass surgery. Um, I'm doing okay. I'm dealing okay with the pain. Um, today is my very first day not having any of the liquid lower tab or liquid Tylenol. Um, everyone that doesn't know this, I was completely unaware. Uh, you cannot take um, NSAIDs or NSAIDs medicines, which includes ibuprofen. So even if they tell you that you can take children's Motrin at the hospital, like one of my nurses did, do not believe them. You cannot have ibuprofen. You are going to have to have Tylenol and other acetaminophen stuff the rest of your life. Even if you have rheumatoid arthritis or, or anything like that, you cannot have an anti-inflammatory like that. So please be aware. I didn't know this until after I had surgery. It wouldn't have deterred me um, because I, I'm blessed to not have RA or, or anything that I would need uh, a constant um, anti-inflammatory for. However, that's, you know, that's the news that I got. Um, I did okay while I was in the hospital. Had a difficult time catching up with my pain because my nurse, uh, we would call her at four hours, a hey, time for some pain medicine. It would take her about an hour and a half to two hours to get to me with that pain medicine. So, and it was already up for an hour by the time I called her. So I'd be okay for three hours and I'd be really bad for two, two and a half, three hours. Okay for three hours, really bad for two, two and a half, three hours. So, um, please make sure that whoever it is, you stay on top of them. And if you don't like your nurse, if you don't like who it is that's, you know, not giving you your pain medicine when you need it, please speak up. I didn't and I wish that I had. Um, it's, you know, that's, that's a choice I wish I had made to kind of be a little more of a bitch, to be honest with you. Um, so I'm doing okay. I'm going to give you guys a little body shot. Um, some folks had a difficult time, like, rolling over, sleeping on their sides and stuff. I didn't I slept on my side the first night, but that was thanks to, uh, morphine, you know, my, my morphine press that I had. I don't know if you'd see a, a past video. Okay, so here is a body shot to give you guys a little bit of show and tell on my boo-boos. So, let's get to it here. Sorry. 